Pakistan has restricted George Soros and his philanthropy from working in the nation subsequent to finding that his associations have connections to the CIA. The Pakistani government has toughened its position on household and worldwide non-legislative gatherings, charging no less than 10 outside supported guide gatherings of utilizing their work as a cover for undercover work. Heritz.com reports, in January, it requested around 12 gatherings dealing with ladies' issues and human rights to end their operations. A delegate of the Pakistan Humanitarian Forum, PHF, which speaks to 63 worldwide guide gatherings, said the Ministry of Interior had issued 10 of its individuals' letters of dismissal, which means their applications to enroll had been rejected. The gathering did not distinguish the 10 gatherings but rather two worldwide gatherings, the Pakistani branch of the Soros Philanthropy the Open Society Foundations, and ActionAid, said they had been advised they needed to close. We clearly find what has happened both disillusioning and shocking, and are critically looking for illumination," the official chief of the Open Society's Pakistani office, Sabah Kadak, said in an announcement. The gathering had burned through $37 million on stipends and help with Pakistan since 2005, she said. The inside service did not react to demands for input. Notwithstanding, the service, in a letter to one of the ten gatherings and seen by Reuters, said its enrollment application had been denied. Twist up operations, exercises of above said Ingo inside 60 days, the service said in the letter. It gave a motivation behind why the gathering needed to stop its work. The service records 139 worldwide non-administrative associations (INGO) on its site that have submitted enlistment applications of which 72 are as yet being handled. There is no rundown of those whose applications have been denied. Amid the protracted Ingo enlistment process we gave all the data and reports required and are certain we follow every single essential control and controls," ActionAid Nation Chief Iftikhar Nizami said in an announcement. This year, Therapeutic Philanthropy Medicines Sands Frontiers was requested to stop work at three offices in viciousness tormented ethnic Pashtun territories flanking Afghanistan, in spite of the fact that the inside service records the gathering as an endorsed Ingo. The Save the Children Help aggregate fell afoul of the administration in 2011, when it was connected to a Pakistani specialist selected by the CIA to help in the chase that prompted the slaughtering of al-Qaeda activist pioneer Osama container laden in the town of Abbottabad. Spare the Children's remote staff were removed from Pakistan not long after the allegations surfaced, yet more than 1,000 neighborhood staff kept on working. The philanthropy denied any connections with the specialist or the CIA.